Hey guys, today uh, I'm going to do a, a relatively quick video on a, on, a, on a new amp I've come across. Uh, it may not be new new to, to, to everybody out there, but it's the, the first one that I've owned. Uh, this is a Fender uh, Mustang 3. It's a 100 watt, 112 um, modeling amp combo. Um, I've always been a Line 6 guy when it comes to any kind of modeling or, or, or solid state amps. I'm not a big fan of solid state amps. I, I, I own mainly tubes, but I needed something that had enough volume to gig with, and the price was right on this, so I went and tried one, and also the weight is right with this. It's like 32 pounds. Um, Fender finally got something right, and I know everyone out there is going to say woo. Um, their solid state amps, in my experience, in my humble opinion, have been trash. Um, never been worth owning, with the exception of a few. Uh, satellite extension amp, the VM wasn't bad, but other than that, they really haven't been worth owning. Um, this amp does it all. It does it all right. And it was very intuitive and, and, and smart of them the way they put it together. I guess they tried for a long, long time and they got it right. Um, first off, nice, big, bright LCD. You can see everything here. Easily accessible uh, amp model, stomp mod, delay and reverb buttons. Um, easy, just turn it off. You know, without, uh, you can tweak them, hold it down, and it goes right into the 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 the, the, uh, the effect of your choice, and um, does a really good job. The Fuse software does an even better job. It's freaking awesome. But on the fly, if you need something done, right there, and a, and another single knob, you turn it to change patches, you press it to modify. It's it, it's just great. And then of course over here, your standard controls, master volume, reverb. Um, bass, middle, treble, volume, and gain in a single input. Um, you know, nothing special, you say, but it is because what happens is right now I'm working with a, a, a 57 Deluxe, uh, what they call the Chimey. I've got overdrive and a small hall reverb um, integrated in, but I'm playing and I, I don't really like what I'm hearing. It's not cutting through the mix, so I want to change something. Well, all I do is spin whatever I want to change and you see it's it changes there in the patch so I that's it you don't have to go in and mess with menus and, and, and deck around it's right here I want more gain I take more gain I want more volume or less volume I do it here and the nice thing about it is as soon as you change it the save button lights red so if I like it I simply hit that and it's changed if I don't like it I can you know go in go out of it and back into it again and there you are you haven't saved it so I can change it at the moment I can do what I need for that time and then get rid of it if I don't want it on the fly uh, auxiliary in um, I've got a uh, my iPhone hooked up to it so I, I you can play tracks through it yeah. and the sound is unclouded whatsoever it comes through beautiful and natural uh, uh, phones another eighth inch stereo out which again mutes the speaker gives you headphone ability when you're practicing or don't want to disturb anybody it also lets you record out in stereo it's it's wonderful USB uh, right into your computer so you can change patches update patches change them use the fuse software you can also use uh, uh, mp3 uh, and, and wave files and jam with bands it's it's really neat the way it works it's very nice in the back uh, um, foot switch for a two button or a four button foot switch input there's also a, a nice effects loop Nothing fancy. Really cool new carbon fiber Tolex. I like it a lot, but it needs corner protection, um, which I'm going to add. Now, the two-button foot switch, simple, simple. It's two-button foot switch, up, down, that's it, which this one comes with. The Mustang 4, which is a 150-watt 212 combo, and the 5 come with this. Um, fantastic foot switch. As you can see, Right now it's in mode one. In mode one, it gives you what they call quick access. So I go 
that's my 36, which is uh, my surfy twin reverb. This gives me 71, which is my high gain. This gives me patch 33, which is that chimey deluxe again. Um, nice. So, you know, there's your three amps that you need for your show. But then if you want something else, you go into mode two, and it just turns into a straight up and down patch. What even makes it cooler is here we're going down, you hit the third button, and it goes down in tens. And you go up, it goes up in tens. Which, <laughs> for anybody who's, who's had to go through 100 patches, is awesome. Then in your mode three, what it does is you see now this 40, which is actually a double track stack. It's a British 80s, so this is a Marshall. Um, it has chorus and tape delay. And now we in mode three, you're in stomp box mode. So you have your, your, your um, patch, and then you can just turn your effects on and off as you wish. So it kind of works like a regular pedal board back into here okay um what i'm going to do now is uh play some stuff for you we'll set this up so everything is nice and visible and uh we'll play a little bit let you hear what it sounds like um here's a surfy reverb that's uh playing that with a uh with a gretch actually found almost all of them without exception are fine exactly the way they are um, and there's great patches in here um, the other one I use is called uh, uh, Monday Gain which is a uh, metal amp actually with some tape delay and I put a 63 fender plate reverb in it so it gives you See a little bit of reverb in there, some gain. It's it, it's it's really nice to you. The other one that I that I use is that Chimey Deluxe. It's a '57 Fender Deluxe with some overdrive and uh, small hall reverb. So if we go into the, um, I'm in mode three now. So there we've got reverb and some overdrive. I want my overdrive off, it's just that simple. Let's go to a strat. Put the overdrive on. And then you're back into your rhythm section. So with four buttons and that mode switch, you can do anything. Uh, the other thing I wanted to mention was, as you, as you probably noticed, we go... It is instantaneous, which some of us that use solid-state modelers can attest to. That's a real pain in the butt when your, your, your switches don't go instantly. Delay sucks, and this has none. Um, so we'll go back into there. So now we're back into mode one. Real easy. Press down on it, and it's your tuner. So now you have your tuner on the pedal. You can check nice and quick. You know where you are all the time. A little bit out on the G string, and we're good. Back in you go, just like that. Beautiful. Let's uh, let's try something here, shall we?
hundred times. <laughs> Otherwise, that's that's pretty much it. Um, beautiful amp. Uh, it's got hundreds of presets. I can't go through them all, but it goes all the way from. Let's just give you an idea. Uh, solos, so American '90s amps, uh, metal, '65 twin, Bassman, uh, British, live album, Johnny Marr cleans. This is a Princeton. This is a beautiful preset, chorus and tape delay. But what else it has is this this one in particular. This is what they've done to simulate two champs. So this is two champs in stereo. It's a it's a really really neat sound. Anyway, that's just a really cool one I thought of. Anyway, uh, we're over 10 minutes now, so I'm going to cut it. The Fender Mustang 3 112 100 watt combo um, with the four button foot switch. Awesome, awesome value. Like $299 for a 100 watt solid state gigging amp, uh, which does it all, in my opinion. Uh, I couldn't say enough about it. Uh, I have. It's a it's fun to play, which is not what you can say about a lot of amps anymore. It's not confusing. It's not a pain in the ass, but it's a blast to play. So get out and try one. Uh, you will buy it. You can't for for the price. These things should be in your in in your arsenal. But get out and try one. Um, the four is, controls are all identical on the three, four, and five. Just the four is 150 watt stereo 212, and the five is 150 watt stereo head and cab. Um, try it. Fender did one that I like. Awesome. Have a good day, man. And give me some comments. Let me know what you think. Uh, help me make better videos. Later.